Hi, Emmy. Um, it's your husband here, Nick. Um, still weird to say. I love you so much. You're my constant happiness, and I just love you so much, and I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. And, you know, have kids that aren't furry, not non-fur babies. I love you so much, babe. everyone. God bless you. Welcome to St. Michael the Archangel Parish on this wonderful occasion. Good news in the kingdom. Uh, Emily and Nick have come together through God's providence to share in the sacrament of holy matrimony. May the church exalt you on this day in which you establish between yourselves a partnership for the whole of your lives with the help and the grace of God. Nicholas and Emily, my friends in Christ, you have come together here in this church so that the Lord may seal and strengthen your love in the presence of the church's minister, in the presence of this living body of Christ. Since it is your intention to enter into holy matrimony, join now your right hands and looking at each other into one another's eyes, seeing each other, and declare your consent before Almighty God and His church. I, Nicholas, take you, Emily, for my lawful wife to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health until death do us part. I, Emily, take you, Nicholas, for my lawful husband, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health until death do us part. It is an honor to introduce to you Mr. and Mrs. Nicholas and Emily Rokakis.
I got to see her score her only goal, and I let everyone know it. I stood up in the stands, and I said, That's my daughter! I can't begin to tell you how proud and how much Chris and I love her uh, and how she turned out. She's responsible, respectful, and very loving. She knows what she wants and she's willing to work for it. In honor of Grandma Hauser, who's been gone for 10 years now, let's say her favorite line, my daughters and any other of the nieces and nephews, on the count of three. One, two, three. No eating, no treaty. Thank you. Tom stopped the tape to smooth over the fight, and when the camera started rolling again, he zoomed in on a four-year-old Emily, now stuffed awkwardly into that baby swing. It may seem like an insignificant moment, but I think it speaks volumes of who Emily is. As a nurse, she gives her time and her love to little babies who need it the most. As a friend, she listens and truly cares what's going on in our lives. And as a daughter and a sister, she's present for her family and would go to the ends of the earth for them. And now as a wife to you, Nick, she will love you unconditionally all the days of your life. She'll care for you, laugh with you, and sacrifice for you. She's going to give up the good swing for you. <laughs> Please raise your glasses to Mr. and Mrs. Rokakis. <laughs> the doctor said congratulations, Mr. and Mrs. Rokakis. You have yourself a beautiful baby. And that was it. <laughs> Treat Emily good. Treat Emily well. She is a princess. She's going to make a wonderful mom one day. Emily, treat Nick well. He's a prince. And he really knows how to keep things fresh. Oh. I guess you could say my brother's a fresh prince. Freddie Mac, spin it! On West Swalley Road is where my brother was raised in the basement is where he spent most of his days. I laughed to myself thinking, sure she is, Nick. You got a small brain and you got a small imagination. If anything, I can say that this couple's rare, but I figured it ain't my wedding. Why should I care? <laughs>